New developments tonight on the luminosity tickets controversy. We talked a little bit about this yesterday. The light show at Washington Park. It's supposed to be free, but you do need a ticket to get in. And those were snatched up in 12 minutes yesterday morning. And they're being sold now online for big bucks. So Vice Mayor David Mann is calling for an investigation. WLWT News 5's Emily Wood live now with the new developments. Emily. Good evening, Mike. In the city of Cincinnati, there is an anti scalping law in place for selling a ticket for more than the face value unless you are a licensed ticket operator. But online, there are some ways around it. Logging on to websites like Craigslist and eBay, we found three posts for tickets. On Craigslist, it's a simple trade and clearly says tickets not for sale. On eBay, two sets of tickets are up for bid, one close to $160. eBay policy says, quote, most tickets to events where all tickets are free to the public are not allowed, end quote. You know, there are people who are undoubtedly going to game the system. Um, I would just remind everyone this is a free community event made possible by fantastic sponsors. <laughs> In addition to providing the luminosity soundtrack, the Cincinnati Symphony Orchestra runs the event and picked Ticketmaster to handle the distribution of tickets. But Vice Mayor David Mann says he wants an investigation. We want to know why the tickets went so quickly and whether that process got in the way of wide distribution of the tickets. We want as many people as possible to have access to this wonderful event. Bulk orders and scalping online is what man is worried about, but CSO says it is already checking on each order to make sure no more than four tickets are released per household. All the orders have to be approved if someone went more than uh, ordered more than four tickets. We'll be able to release those tickets because that, that order will be voided then. If you shop online, CSO says be careful what you bid for. A ticket online might not be approved by CSO, and the seller will then have your money and leave you with a voided ticket that will not get you in to Luminosity. Reporting live in Washington Park, Emily Wood, WLWT News 5. All right, Emily.